Hola, dear Portuguese friends and colleagues. As General Rapporteur on the Rights of LGBTI People at the Parliamentary Assembly of the Council of Europe, I would like to share a few thoughts with you about the very important legislation you are debating right now in Portugal. I am referring to the legislation regarding the protection of people born with an intersex condition. At the Council of Europe we did a report on this very specific issue and we came to the conclusion that all member states of the Council of Europe should have a formal ban on medically unnecessary treatment, being it surgery, hormonal treatment, sterilization, etc., on young intersex children until the intersex children themselves can be part of the decision-making process. We see it as a severe violation of their basic human rights when this type of very invasive medical treatments are undertaken on them without they have been able to discuss it with their doctors, their parents, etc. And there's a second reason why we feel we should never do this. People born with an intersex condition are different. That's correct. But they are not ill. They don't need to be treated. They don't, they don't need to be fixed. We should accept them and we should respect them the way they are. And that's why we feel that all forms of medical interventions on intersex people should only be taken when they have been able to be part of the decision-making process. It is about self-determination, it is about respect for the bodily integrity and the physical autonomy of each and every people, also young children. And I know this is a very sensitive and difficult discussion. But believe me, I've spoken to many intersex people themselves and they really feel this kind of medical interventions should be postponed and should not be undertaken on young children. I wish you a very fruitful debate and I am confident that Portugal will be on the forefront of countries at the European level to protect the human rights of intersex people. Até mai stagi.